We're going to see now how to show histograms of an image and um, what is histogram. So an histogram gives us the intensity of each color for the image, put it in simple words. So let's see it. First we import CV2, import numpy as np and then we need matplotlib module and then six and cycler they uh, we need them just to make matplotlib work so three new models let's install them so we go to project and a project interpreter and then matplotlib install package then six Install package and one is cycler. Install package. Then from matplotlib import by plot as plt. Now let's create an image. Img equals CV, um, actually, we created with numpy mp dot zeros. Let's create a really small image of just 100 by 100. So 100 pixels, 100 pixels of height and 100 of width. Then np dot u int 8. Let's show this image cv 2im show emg emg cv 2weight key zero cv 2destroy all windows. We show the image. Here we have the image. It's all black. Actually, here we see a gray part just because Windows cannot show a smaller, cannot show, cannot show it smaller than this. But our image is only this black part. Now let's show the histogram for this image. Let's delete the CV2 weight key and destroy all Windows. And now we are going to use matplotlib so just copy this one plt.hist emg.revel then the size of the histogram 256 the range from 0 to 0 to 256 and then plt.show so this is the range of our colors because each pixel can go only from 0 to 256 in this case not included so to 255 and now we run the code we have here our image and here the histogram. Uh, okay. So as we know, the image is 100 pixels of width and 100 of height. So in total has 100 per 100, 1000 pixels, all black. And as we know, each black pixel has the value of uh, its zero. So we see the histograms for the pixel with value 0. It's telling us that we have one one, actually 10,000 one by 100, not 1,000, but 10,000 pixels. What if we put something else? Let's say we draw a rectangle, half of the image, a white rectangle. 
so cv2 dot rectangle on the image first point will be 0 50 so exactly half and then last point will be 100 and 100 the color we want it to be white so 255 thickness minus one what which means make it full so fill it with the white let's show the rectangle and the histogram so here we have the rectangle the actually the image it's half black and half white so we know that all the image has 10,000 pixels half of them are black so have value 0 and we see so with value 0 we have 5,000 pixels and with value 255 we have again 5,000 5, pixels we can draw something else like a circle cv2 dot circle on the image uh, then the point in the center so let's say some point like fifty fifty radius of twenty five the color let's say somewhere in the middle from black and white so one hundred twenty seven um, let's see actually I don't remember if I can fill the circle uh, let's say thickness minus one I think so minus one okay we have it and here now the histogram is a bit different uh, you can see now that we have many pixels so around 4000 black 4000 white and then around 2000 pixels with the value 127 and now you can see this just three of them because we have just three different values but let's take for example another image and let's show a histogram of a normal image we can delete all this let's load an image EMG actually I have an image here CRC beach no actually I want to use this one so now we're going to show the histogram of this image so you can download this image from the link that will be on the description cbeach.jpg so cv2.imread c ah, actually not cbeach just c.jpg jpg uh, but first we want to make the histogram of the grayscale image imread grayscale so this is our image and this is the histogram so we see the image we have different lightning this part is really black really dark so most likely this part is showing the histogram with these pixels so pixels that have value from 0 to 50 are this one and then probably this uh, really light part of the sky is this one and the rest of the image is this and this what if we want to show the histogram for 
the color so we can but we need first to split and to show the history of each color so we have three colors we have EMG we have V G R equals to CV2 dot split EMG so for example it we will take the histogram of the blue how much how much is the intensity of the blue the green and the red so let's even show these images mm. now I'm going to comment let's first show the history only for the blue but I'm going to show the blue so it will be B then CV2 dot in show green G CV2 dot in show red R Well, actually when we split the channels of this image they are all really similar probably it's not the best image to take as example so let's take another image C uh, I have the second one C beach dot JPG let's even show the full image CV2 dot em show EMG and EMG so we have this image and then we have three different channels we have the blue we have the green and we have the red so all these three channels combined blue green and red gives us this image and then we can create a histogram for each channel so we have in this case this one for the blue then we can create second one for the for the green and third one for the red green and red and we can show them okay uh, actually it's BGR here is the histogram uh, this histogram will be really useful later on to apply some filters or some adaptive thresholding so to un to understand how to work with the images and that's all for this video